हेलो स्टूडेंट्स यू आर मोस्ट वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल और ई लर्निंग क्लास मेन मोटो ऑफ नो मेन मोटो ऑफ इंट्रोड्यूसिंग माय वीडियोस फॉर यू टू मेक द स्टडी ऑफ फिजिक्स एंड इट्स न्यूमेरिकल्स मोर इज एंड आल्सो एनेबलिंग यू टू सॉल्व वेरियस न्यूमेरिकल्स बिलोंग्स टू अदर बुक्स अदर पब्लिकेशंस today i am here trying to solve the exercises of ncert chapter number 12 due to the uh, space crisis i am here only going to mention on solve question number 4 5 and 9 in the next video you will be able to see the solution of question number 6 7 and 8 okay so stay tuned okay question number 4 the question number 4 says that two conducting wires of same material and of equal length and equal diameter are means here the question is hinting you that uh, the resistivity of the material due to the equal diameter same diameter same nature of the material and of equal lengths the resistivity and resistance both are equal the question convincing you this so get a hint in this way and I start further first connected in series and then in parallel with the in a circuit across the same potential means potential of the source that is being introduced here are equal in both cases the ratio of the heat produced in series and parallel combination would be here are the options 1 ratio 2 2 ratio 1 1 ratio 4 or 4 ratio 1 okay let us with let us start with the first case when these resistors are connected in series wise okay and potential drop is uh, b volt heat in series condition that is represented by hs there i have represented it by hs keep in mind you know hs is equal to v i t very good v that is v i according to ohm's law we have i is equal to v upon r so i have put here v v voltage of entire circuit and the resistance of the entire circuit r plus r in series you know that to get the equivalent resistance we have to add both of them okay r plus r means 2r and here t is as it is so we have finally v square t upon 2r okay now in the condition of parallel combination have a glance that in this condition the i ip ip means current in parallel combination okay there ip t is given so let's start with v is v ip ip means v upon r what is the resistance equivalent resistance you know equivalent resistance in parallel combination 1 by r plus 1 by r so we will have 1 by sorry 1 plus 1 by r means 2 by r therefore rp will be equal to r upon 2 okay so here i have put the value of ip v upon since you know i is equal to v upon r according to ohm's law okay so on solving this we have got finally this one and hence the ratio of hs upon hp means heat generated in series condition series wise condition combination and heat generated in parallel wise combination we have put the value of hs as well as hp here on solving this we finally get one ratio 4 you can 
have a glass. Is that okay? We have question number 5. The question number 5 says that how is a voltmeter connected in circuit to measure the potential difference between two points, two points of the circuit uh, of the register are this one and this one. We have to measure the potential difference across the ends of this register or two point. So we have to connect this. You know very well that I have in I have mentioned already it in the previous video that how a voltmeter and how a an emitter are connected should be connected in the circuit. Circuit में कैसे जोड़ा जाता है? इस चीज के बारे में पहले इस चीज़ के वीडियो में बता चुके हैं। तो देखिए, a voltmeter should be connected in a circuit in parallel wise combination. In what combination? Parallel wise combination. Because of the following reasons. The first reason is that we have high resistance value. Emitter has low resistance. Keep keep in mind that emitter has low resistance. On the other hand, the voltmeter has higher resistance, and that's why we prefer it to combine in parallel wise combination. This is the first reason, and the second one reason is saying that in parallel combination it can be measured. It can measure the potential across the ends of all different devices. Means our home, in our home. There are number of there are number of electronic devices, and we want to uh, maintain the potential difference across the ends of these regi these resistors or devices. 220 volt means same voltage. Then we should have preferred to join it or connect it in parallel wise. Why? Because in parallel voltage is not going to be disturbed. Okay, that is not going to be altered. And that's why we prefer it to join in parallel wise combination. Okay? So here yeah, written in parallel combination it can be measured, it can measure the potential difference across the ends of all different devices used in the circuit as potential difference does not change across the ends of the devices in parallel combination. You know it very well. Now come to the question 9. I have not solved after 5, 6, 7 and 8. This, uh, these, these questions uh, will take more and more discussions and due to the crisis of, crisis of the space here, I have managed to solve the question number 9. Okay? A battery of 9 volt is connected in series with a resistor of 0.2 ohm, 0.3 ohm, 0.4 ohm, 0.5 ohm and 12 ohm respectively. How much current would flow through the 12 ohm resistor? I have to calculate it. Okay? Means, what is the magnitude of current that is passing through 12 ohm resistor? Okay? You know it very well that in series combination, the entire circuit has the same current. Means, the devices, whatever the devices are connected in the circuit must must be a same current because the series combination current is not going to be altered. Okay, they, that is not going to be disputed in different channels. Okay, but in parallel, but in parallel, the current were divided in uh, along the different channels. Okay, since whatever I have told that is mentioned here, since we know that. Uh, in series combination, current through each register is same. Therefore, current through 12 ohm register would be the same as the current of entire circuit. Pure circuit ko jo current pass ho rahi hai, bas wahi current aapko 12 ohm wale register se bhi ho kar pass karegi. Yehi baat humne yahan likha hai. Thik hai? Here. Pure circuit ka resistance hum nikal lete hai. Pure circuit mein kya current jo hai? पास हो रहा है इसको कैलकुलेट करने के लिए पूरे सर्किट का क्या चाहिए रेजिस्टेंस चाहिए पूरे सर्किट का वोल्टेज चाहिए तभी आप उस डाटा के बिहाफ पर जो है करंट को निकाल सकते हैं आर सीरीज सिंस ऑल द रेजिस्टर्स आर कनेक्टेड इन सीरीज वाइज कॉम्बिनेशन दैट्स व्हाई वी हैव एडेड 
the all the value the value of all register here. Okay. After adding this, we have got what? 13.4 ohm. And voltage? Voltage is given to the entire circuit is 9 volt. Okay. That's why I will be equal to entire voltage means gross voltage upon gross resistor resistance. So here I'm putting the value of D and R. We have 9 upon 13.5 and that is after calculating we can get it as 0.67. You can calculate it. So find try to write if the phones are looking so small that I am going to increase it for some time please note it So friends, in the next video, I would explain and solve, try to solve question number uh, 5, 6, sorry, 6, 7 and 8 because they have not been adjusted on the blackboard or green board. So stay tuned and uh, make some positive feedback that I made. I will put some better to you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much.